Hey everybody, Chaotic here, and obviously I'm back on AOPG again, because I can't live a week without this game, apparently. But, uh, yeah, someone in my comment section asked me to make something to a guide, so I thought, instead of actually making a guide, I'd do something kind of similar. Uh, in this one, we're just gonna be, uh, doing some goals over here, like, uh, stuff that a random new person would need. Like, finding a devil fruit, knowing how to remove one, knowing how to buy one. Um, go for titles, which islands that I think are the best for finding devil fruits. Um, getting stuff like the island tracker and um, what else? The the quest the questing system to get all five um, quest thing things. I don't know what you call it, but yeah. Oh, and to get hockey, of course. You get everything all in this one video, and then. Um, yeah, that's basically it. Anyway, uh, you're gonna get a bit of voiceover Danny, aka me, and you're gonna get um, uh, recording Danny as well. I don't know, maybe I might talk to myself, who knows? Anyway, roll the clips. Hey everyone, Chaotic here, coming at you from AOPG, and today we're gonna be doing a quick little uh, level up guide. I say level up, uh, not quite. I have a couple of goals to do today, especially in this game, because people saying it's like paid away and then this and all that. So, um, let's get some stuff done and we'll see how paid to win and how uh, hard it is to actually, you know, beat the game as some people are thinking it is. So, first of all, obviously we got in the game, we have a free roll over here, hopefully get times two money or something, maybe, I have no idea. I got double drop, eh, not worth it early on, but sure. Alright, next, we can do the codes. Where do I need to do the codes? Uh, two title spins, one reset double fruit, and times two gems. These, I don't know if you're gonna put like a, um, a thing to show them because after like a week or so, they do expire pretty quickly and people who don't get them, well, you know. So let's do uh, this one. There you go, two title spins. Done, that one works. Okay, now you can just see me only running around the starter island trying to find a double fruit. I sadly did not find any, but yeah. Major sucks. I mean, I think um, in yeah the first two recordings I did for this, I actually did find both fruits on, well, starter island. Also, you saw me point to the bandit leader. You'll see why later on in a second, because we're going to be farming him. Nothing else, just basically him for the recording. But anyway, check this out. Buy me a sailboat, get in the sailboat, and we're off. First one up is we're gonna be going to Orange Town, yeah, I believe. Or is that buggy? No, 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 I'm going to Orange Town. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's why is the sun so bright? Ew, I don't know. Oh, that's I don't know. Terrible. Okay, keep going this way. I think you're gonna see the phoenix nest right over here. That is it, right? Yes, no, yeah, that, that's it. This over here is the phoenix nest, that's where Marco and uh, Katakuri is, that we are going to be fighting at some point. Hopefully we get light to do it with, so then I can just cheese them constantly, but if we don't, we can just do some other long range move. Um, and the last thing for testing on a different ult account, I did manage to get Mera at the start, which made things a heck of a lot easier, but I'm hoping I get Chop or something on this one, because... If I do, it means I have to get like a starting point that isn't as good as everyone else's. Or something that you guys can get. Like if I can do it with Chop, you guys can do it with Logia. Right? That's that's basically the the point I'm trying to get across, pretty much. Okay, yeah, didn't find anything on Orange Island either. I need to like um just say this now. The reason why I'm showing the exact directions where I'm going is because uh, the starter people, they don't really have uh, enough money for an island tracker, right? Obviously, which is 50,000. So yeah, just follow my movements. It's sped up currently. You can go to the islands that I would usually go to to find devil fruits because there's always fruits there, to be honest. Because no one goes there. Everyone can just buy devil fruits at this point. But yeah, that's how I go from those islands to those islands. Uh, this one, I am going to get the title spins and show you where to get the title spins uh, for gems plus uh, where you can get the the fruit merchant and to awaken your fruit. It's on Logtown. I didn't realize there was a uh, spinning thing on the top of my screen over there, you know, top left. See it spinning? 
Yeah, I didn't realize, but I still went to Logtown anyway to try and get a Double Fruit, which I did not get, so... R.I.P. me, I basically went there for nothing, but you know what, I might as well show it off now, and um, yeah, you're about to see something pretty, pretty lucky. I got, I got a good um, title. Titles actually do help with stats and buffs and stuff, but you know, you'll see it in the clip. Title spin, come here. Kinda, yeah, I can sell you a title. Not enough gems. Where do I, oh wait. Spinning. Title spins. There you go. I don't know why I did all that. Alright. Uh, you can see these are the possible rewards. Swordsman, Sniper, Fruit, Double Fruit User, uh, Merchant is a good one for Belly. Gem Merchant for gems, obviously. And then, like, um, these are the first set. Then, um, the, what, or is it? Trainee Swordsman, which is a bit higher, a bit advanced. Then Trainee Sniper, Skill, Double Fruit User, Strong. And then you just keep going and going and going until you get to like these of the the best one. I think this one is uh, I don't miss it for snipers. This one is just like what I don't even know what this one is to be honest, because I don't I don't none of us in the crew have it. And yeah, Dark Prince. I kind of want this one, but yeah, hmm, Dark Prince is right there. King of the Pirates, right there. <laughs> Dark was it dead something? Ah, uh, Dead Eye. Oh, that's what it is. All right. Let's go! Wish me luck! A banker? What the hell is a banker? Or a... <gasps> Increases oil belly gain by 1.5! Yo! Okay, yeah, I'm taking that. Thank you. Okay, now you can see me. After I went to Logtown, I came directly back to the starter island. It's not that far away. It's like right between... On the opposite side of ice, sorry. I diverge a little bit because I am not going back to starter. I'm going to the island behind that, which is the fourth island that you need to go to after you um, leave starter, right? I say that those those types of things won't really matter too much later on. You'll see why. But this one is the fourth island. It's called Fishman Island. And they do, I think they have like hockey or because they're fishmen, they do affect Devil Fruit users, including Logias. So if you're a Logia, it's not going to help you here. Logia is only useful for like the first three islands and then you're done. <laughs> anyway, hopped up on the island, nothing there. I went to check for Devil Fruits, there was like straight up nothing at all. So you know what, I was like, screw that, I'm going to go to one more spot and that was Shellstown. Um, really quick. The reason why we're not going to be going to island 2 two and 3 is because they don't have bosses like the first island. I don't know why am I looking up at the sun. What am I looking for? Oh, Skypea. That's what it was. Yeah, I couldn't find that shit. Hey, fuck Skypea. We're not going to go there anyway. Um, this It's way too far. Not enough stamina and all that jazz. Who cares? But as we're on our way to uh, shells down over here, which you can't even see in the distance. I don't know why I'm circling something. Yeah, they, there is no bosses on Island 2, 3, and even Arlong. So this is why we're staying on um, the Starter Island, because it gives 20,000 cash for one mob. That's really good. And it's not something, uh, you know, you can pass up. It's like, it's, it's, a easy, uh, it's an easy clap if you beat them, and then you get some, uh, some, a good amount of money. You can do some stuff later. More on that after, though. Anyway. We're on the island, uh, didn't really find anything, but I did find this. Oh! Well then. Uh-huh. <laughs> I got a lightning fruit, sweet. Um, nice. There might be a devil fruit somewhere around. Maybe. There wasn't. As you can see, those guys actually have an island tracker over there, which we will be getting relatively soon, just not yet. Oh, huh. I don't know. It doesn't concern me though. Let's see. One quick look around. If we got nothing, well, all right. We're about to pop off in a second. Let's see how fast we're gonna beat these guys in their bounties. I'm gonna get the strongest in a couple minutes from now. Oh yeah, it took like what get twenty out minutes. of there. <laughs> the chest. Where are they? What? Huh? Meliodas. 
And who's this other guy? TH Luca. I don't think they're supposed to be able to run over there. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't think they <laughs> Um Hey Zuri, the boss. I know you've seen my videos before. You mind getting uh <laughs> You can go get those guys. I don't know why they're able to run on water. Unless it's a bug and it better be a visual glitch, I swear to god. Like maybe one of them has ice or something and I can't see it from that far away. No, but they were sub uh, they're probably hacking. Probably hacking. No, they weren't. I was okay. correct. Um, I can't do anything about that. The guy that, was so. using ice and yeah. I Miss mean, eat this lightning fruit. Nom nom. <laughs> there we go. Lightning speed and whatever, whatever. 350 is what we need to get. So let's get on right with that, shall we? We can go and skip straight to the bandit leader. Mm hmm And what we want to do is we want to get 500,000 for Zuri to get the um, the increased level Fast. thing. Fast yes. In increased quest um, tasks. There yeah, you, you can get like five of them total, but you know. All right. We need to get that and we need to talk to this traveling merchant over here who will give us a um, an island tracker for 50,000, but we don't need that right now. As mm -hmm. Why would we? Yeah. You can get that. You guys can get that on your own time, but yeah, uh, twenty thousand per per kill for this dude. That's really good. So you know, just keep doing this until you get five hundred thousand. That's simple. Obviously, the more you do it, the stronger you get. And then um. Uh, something I didn't realize, which was a recent update or something. I can't even remember when it happened, but when you kill a mob now instead of only getting exp for uh, sorry instead of only getting belly and some exp for the thing you're using you actually get um xp for all your stats not just one uh like stamina that you were using and um strength and stuff all oh, it's so good all right zap 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 oh level up now we have the 500,000 we need, so we can quickly come over here, get this. Thank you. We can get the quest scroll from Missouri Senpai over there. Boop. And yeah, now we can actually take two quests at once. That's all we needed from this island. So what we will be doing now is we're going to be going on over and then you're going to see where we're going to be, which is all right. Man. Are they looking for fruits or something? But it's time. Uh, 226. Uh, four minutes remaining until another fruit spawns. Okay. So as you can probably see by now, uh, after you get the second quest unlocked, you should have enough stats and you can skip all the way to the fourth island, aka Fishman Island. I have tried it with um, Chop, so it's not that hard, okay? It's, it's pretty easy to do. Oh, look. I found a string. Forgot about that. <laughs> Yeah. After we do that, we're gonna go for the uh, the strongest quest on this thing, which is a ten stronger fishmen. We're gonna beat up all of these guys. It really didn't even take that long, to be honest with you. It took like ten, fifteen minutes or something. I don't know. This this recording took like two hours, two hours thirty minutes because of trying to figure out codes. But you know, other than that, yeah, we we were good. We were good. And then after we uh after we got the seven hundred thousand belly, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go for hockey. That's what you need the seven hundred thousand for. That's why I wanted to push to get the second quest right away, just to get that out of the way. Also, this guy was using berry. I feel sorry for him. Terrible fruit. <laughs> but yeah, again, uh, we wouldn't have an island tracker or anything right now. I don't know if he wanted to buy it or not because well, seven hundred thousand. You could probably easily afford it to be honest with you. So we're going, you can see uh, past the ice island, we're going to Logtown currently, right after Logtown. Is that my boat? Hey, that was my boat. Nice. All reliable. Still there. Nice. I forgot I left that there. <laughs> Only now that I'm watching through the recording and doing the voiceover work, I'm like, oh yeah, that is my boat. But yeah, um, you can see that little dot right over there, which is the raid. Yeah. This is Dawn Island. Right after Dawn Island, you're going to look a certain direction, aka right there, and then you will see the new Alabasta. You can uh, 
you know, look at it right there. And then if you keep going in that direction, you'll see this long shaft, pun intended. And uh, yeah, that's going to be... That's going to be a place called uh, the Random Wilderness. That's where Rayleigh is. And he is at the top of this thing for whatever reason. I have no idea why. And yeah, this took me a little bit because I was trying to figure out how the hell am I going to get up there without a fruit that can fly or the, th the fact that I cannot hold the moves. With certain devil fruits if or like certain moves itself, if you... Uh, hold down a move, it'll just be like uh, stopping the animation and you would stop mid-air, right? Lightning was not uh, doing that, so I was like, how the hell am I supposed to get up there? But all I did was just replenish my stamina and then um, hopped on top. Check it out, look. I'm up there and then that's where I need to be. Mm -hmm. And then I started teleporting and then using a mix of Gepo all the way up and look at my stamina, look at my stamina, see? <laughs> It came in clutch halfway. Aki for mm -hmm. 700,000. There you go. Purchase armament. To use armament, you press G on a fighting style. Boop. Now I have armament. And yeah, I that actually buffs up uh, all of your attacks and whatnot. By what level it is. So the higher your hockey. So like, uh, say my lightning currently is 100, right? I do 100 damage. If I have Haki at level 100 as well, and I equip um, Haki and I use the Lightning, instead of doing 100 damage, because it's level 100, it's going to do 200 damage, because both are level 100. And that logic checks out for you. So yeah, that's how it works. That's how it's going to go. Now that I have that, let's see how fast this thing is going to go, shall we? So, put this on. Now we have hockey, which is always a good sign. Boop. All right. So checklist. Um, what do we want to do remaining? We have to get three more of these quest tasks. And then after we get three more of those, we want to be able to at least buy one devil fruit, which is $25 million or belly in this game. So that's where we are currently at. And we'll see how far we reach. There it is. I think I'm in the yeah I'm in the wrong side. I don't know. All right, island tracker. We want to go to the desert. It's time, and we need to go straight this way. I will see you guys when I actually get there. Cause this is oh yeah island tracker. How do you use it? Yeah, the red thing points the direction you need to go. Ow, the light burns. Okay. I will pause it over here, and I'll see you guys when I get to the uh, the desert. Bunk. Hello, and we are back. We finally managed to make it all the way to the desert island. Didn't even take that long, actually. I'm pretty sure you can still see the wilderness in the distance. It's like right there. That's the wilderness island right over here where uh, Snake Man Luffy is on. And we want to talk to not not Dundon guy. There you go, Bandit leader. Ta-da. I think he's giving like a hundred and something per one, so this should be really good for us. Let's see, let's see, hold on, check this out. How much damage did that do? Oh, oh, that's beautiful amount of damage right there. That's a beautiful amount of damage. Yeah, as I was trying to say, um, right after I, I got like 400k in Fishman Island, I thought it was taking way too long. So you know what? I was like, screw Skype here. I'm, and anything other than that, I'm going to go straight to the desert. And uh, yeah, that's how I ended up here. Fighting the, uh, the mini boss, the desert bandit leader, and not Crocodile, because he is annoying early on. Before I figured out a good way to hit him, with long range attacks that is. But yeah, right now, I'm just going to be... Oh, I died. <laughs> yeah, right now, all I'm just going to be doing is farming this uh, dude over here to see how much money he gives. He gave us a surprising amount, which made me kind of greedy. And I went to go fight Crocodile after.
Oh, there he is. He's gone. 300. Oh, damn. Okay, 397,000 for that. That's, that's, that's really good. Okay. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't think it'd be that much. <laughs> Uh, I'm, uh -huh. I'm kind of tempted to fight Crocodile now. Mostly because I just wanted to fight him, honestly. I might do that. I yep. don't know if it's a good idea to do it. But I'm gonna do it. If I die, I blame everyone but me. And there I go. To fight Crocodile. Anyway, yeah, if you're bored like me and you get bored very easily, just go fight him. Who cares? <gasps> yes! 3.1 million, finally! <laughs> no, I have 4 million dollars, and I'm literally about to spend that on, like, the dumbest thing possible. There you go. Uh, 1 million, yes. I would like one of those, please. Thank you. There you go. So now we can uh, do the third... All right, that's that's the next one. All right, and then the final one is like what two million? Yeah, it's two million for the last one. That I'm gonna be able to get that really soon. Actually, hold on. Yep, quickly went to our long get it came back. Ta da! All right, five maxed out. Nice. And then, uh, yeah, by now you should at least be able to get a uh, thing, right? Like an island tracker. I don't have to tell you to go get certain things. You should be able to already get it. <laughs> anyway, uh, after this, I headed all the way back to the desert again. And I started uh, farming. This time, I kept on farming the uh, bandit leader until I got 5 million. I went to Logtown, talked to this guy, the businessman. Removed my double fruit because in that time, look how many fruits I got. Took my favorite fruit out, the light fruit. Waiting for an awakening, by the way. And then after like about the hour and a half minute mark, I have finally achieved flight. And you know what? After dealing with lightning for so long, this feels so good. <laughs> you have no idea. I spent the next like five minutes just flying around. I didn't even do anything. I just flew around. That was it. It was so nice to be able to fly. Look at this. <laughs> it was so good. <laughs> okay, after that, I went to uh, go fight Marco on Phoenix Island. And all I did, uh, the reason why I like light so much is because I can farm them like this. It, it's pretty easy to do. <laughs> Look at it. Just snipe them from a distance away. And it levels up your stamina by an insane amount. But Marco's about to die, I believe, right? There it is. And zap. Wait, hold on. Hold on. No! No! Come on, Danny. God damn it, he did it when I wasn't looking. Uh, anyway, uh, category is next. He's about to be uh, victimized. There it is. Oh, animation's still going. Yeah, I forgot about that. You can't exactly cancel or uh, stop the animation, so basically stuck like this and then right after that since i got the 44 million even though i took uh, two less quests than normal flew my ass all the way to log town and i was about to buy a fruit finally after about like two hours and 10 minutes somewhere around there and yeah we got all the way to phoenix island and we're making millions now okay which was pretty easy uh if you did it with the sword you could have probably did, done this a little bit earlier than me had to quickly check for the fruits obviously um, but yeah, if you did it with sword, there are long range moves for like, uh, the second sword style or three sword style or something like that. But you know, I like fruits more. So that's what I went with. If you want to do it earlier, use swords, use a long range move for swords. But yeah, here we go. We're about to get our first double fruit for 25 million. There you go. Had to quickly check and see how much for, uh, two fruits. Cause you know, they add on like a little tax, but couldn't afford. And let's see what we get. And it is chop. God damn it! I'd right, fine. 